Hi, I am Latif Shet, currently working as a CRM specialist at ENH Customer Centric Private Limited. ENH Customer Centric Private Limited is a CRM company and Salesforce partner based in Hyderabad. ENH Customer Centric provides the solutions for CRM automation, integrations, mobility and analytics. In this presentation, I am going to explain about Salesforce integration with QuickBooks using Delbovi Atom Sphere. Our agenda is why we go for Salesforce integration with QuickBooks, uses of QuickBooks, what is Delbomi Atom Sphere and how it play the main role to integrate Salesforce with QuickBooks and what are the steps involved to integrate Salesforce with QuickBooks by using Delbomi Atom Sphere. Here we are taking one use case creating customers in QuickBooks from Salesforce accounts. And what are the steps involved to create a customers in QuickBooks from Salesforce accounts by using Delbomi Atom Sphere. Let us start our presentation from here. Why we need to integrate Salesforce with QuickBooks? What are the uses of Salesforce integration with QuickBooks? Salesforce is a CRM application tool where CRM applications are popular business tools because they instantly organize customer data from various channels. QuickBooks is an accounting software program used to manage sales and expenses and keep track of day-to-day -day business transactions like invoicing customers and paying bills. By using this integration, we can maximize the business efficiency. By connecting sales data with accounting data, we can make better business decisions. We can know which products are getting the most service calls and warranties claims. We can better forecast the product mix when making purchasing decisions. We can also see open balances and credit limits from within Salesforce. We can view sales histories for each prospect or customer. We can track every customer touch point. We can enter data once it's automatically updated in both Salesforce and QuickBooks Online. We can minimize duplication and data errors. These are all the uses of this integration. In this slide, we will see the some uses of QuickBooks. Those are manage sales and income, keep track of bills and expenses, run payroll to pay employees, and keep track of inventory quantity and costs. By using manage sales and income, we can keep track of our sales by customer and manage our accounts receivable balances. With the help of keep track of bills and expenses, we can keep track of our purchases by vendor and manage our accounts payable balances. By using run payroll to pay employees, we can easily calculate payroll checks send payroll tax payments electronically and file payroll tax returns. With the help of keep track of inventory quantity and cost, we can keep an eye on all purchases and sales for each item. In this slide, I am explaining about what is Delbumi Atom Sphere and what are the uses of Delbumi Atom Sphere. Delbumi is an integration platform as a service and it is multi-tenant platform that supports cloud-to-cloud -cloud application integrations, SaaS-to-SaaS -SaaS application integrations, and cloud-to-on-premises application integrations. Delbumi Atom Sphere saves the customer's time and reduces errors compared to manual integration. Bumi Atom Sphere allows us to connect any combination of applications with no appliances or software or coding. This integration process is divided into three sections. Those are build, deploy and manage. In build section, we have visual tools to specify the integration logic to communicate between different applications. By using the deploy, we can deploy the integration process in the building phase to a runtime engine called Atom. This Atom allows you to run the integration process in on-premise or in on-cloud. Pomi supports two deployment models, those are 
cloud deployment and on premise deployment in cloud deployment model the endpoints are cloud based we can deploy atom onto delbumi atom cloud in on premise deployment model the endpoint is within a corporate network by using manage we can monitor the health of the integration process in this slide i am explaining about how salesforce will be integrated with quickbooks with the help of bumi atom sphere here we need three orgs those are salesforce or quickbooks or and delbumi atom sphere org. salesforce is source org quickbooks is destination org and delbumi atom sphere is integration platform org we sign up into salesforce quickbooks and delbumi atom sphere and then log into salesforce and create any as object records in salesforce log in into destination org that is quickbooks and create an application to retrieve the salesforce object record information into this log in to delbumi atom sphere to create a process to integrate salesforce with quickbooks in this process we have we need to create different components to do this integration those are salesforce connector component quickbooks connector component and mapping function components and start process the component here i am taking one use case as create customers in quickbooks from salesforce account records by using atom sphere For this integration, we need three orgs. Those are Salesforce, QuickBooks, and Delbumi Atom Sphere. First, sign up into Salesforce. Sign up into Delbumi Atom Sphere and QuickBooks. After successful sign up into Salesforce, QuickBooks, and Delbumi Atom Sphere, log in into Salesforce by giving valid username and password, and go to Accounts tab and create account records and save them there we will find all accounts and this account object will act as source object and these records are to be inserted in quickbooks customers as part of this integration we need to log in into destination or that is quickbooks by giving valid username password and create an application to retrieve the data from salesforce accounts and there we will find all applications available in quickbooks org as part of this integration after successful login to source org and destination org we need to log into integration platform org that is bumi atom sphere org by giving valid username and password and create a process in bumi atom sphere and run this process in this process we have four components those are salesforce connector component quickbooks connector component build map function component start process component by using salesforce connector component we will establish the connection of salesforce and do the salesforce operation as get operation to retrieve the accounts from salesforce and from quickbook connector component we will establish the quickbooks connection by giving valid username and password and we will perform the create operation to insert the account records from salesforce into customers and build up build map function component is used for to map the fields of salesforce accounts and quickbooks customer fields stop process component is used for stop the entire process and 
we need to establish connections in between four components after that run the process the integration of salesforce with quickbooks is established this is the entire process of bumi adam sphere process to integrate salesforce with quickbooks if you observe clearly we have seen four components here those are salesforce connector component quickbooks connector component build map function component stock process component with the help of salesforce connector component we can establish the salesforce connection and we can retrieve the account records information from the salesforce and these records information has to be inserted into the quickbooks customers with the help of quickbooks connector component by using build map function component we can map the account fields in salesforce with quickbooks customer fields and at last we need to start the process by using the stock process component once building the bumi adam sphere process is completed we need to go for test process by clicking on test button here we have two type of test process environments those are test atom cloud environment and on premise atom environment here we are using test atom cloud environment so we chose the test atom cloud environment to test the process and click on run test to run the test process if our process doesn't have any errors then the customers in quickbooks will be created from salesforce accounts as part of this use case i created two account records in salesforce or those are enh c centric india and enh i secure our agenda is these two records has to be inserted in quickbooks customer so the accounts in salesforce are as shown in this slide here we are having four customer records in quickbooks before the integration with salesforce here we are having two more records which came from salesforce account records those are enc centric india and enhi secure these are all the customer records in quickbooks after the salesforce integration by using bumi atoms here 